Happy holidays, everyone. Today's video shares five helpful tips for attending Dapper Day and shares our experience from the holiday outing at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Since Dapper Day is a fashion-centered event, it might be fun to consider coordinating your outfits. Deciding a color palette theme or era will create a more seamless look for your Dapper Day photos. Tip number two is to anticipate the weather for your Dapper Day event and dress accordingly so that you can be comfortable. Which segues into my next tip, which is dressing for your comfort. While Dapper Day is all about dressing your best, remember you're going to be in a theme park. For example, you might want to consider wearing more comfortable shoes to suit your activities. For us, this included being able to walk around, eat, drink, and experience some of the shows and attractions. If you'd rather not stand in line for long queues, I recommend checking out some of the entertainment offerings like the Indiana Jones Stunt Spectacular, which is in a shaded venue with fans. Overall, the most helpful tip you can have to make the most of Dapper Day is to plan ahead of time and prioritize what's important to you. For me, that means getting up early, doing my makeup, and doing my nails and hair the night before. Decide ahead of time if you want to style an updo or practice a new hairstyle. or sew your entire outfit like my friend Liz. If dining is an important element of your Dapper Day, you're going to want to have a reservation. Disney dining reservations tend to book up pretty early, but we were able to snag a lunch reservation at the 50s Primetime Cafe, one of my personal favorites for its mid-century theming and decor. Not to mention the classic homestyle menu and full bar. Very good. Yeah. Very good. Very good. <laughs> the salmon was a hit at the table as well as the special of shrimp and grits. And from the bar, the peanut butter and jelly cocktail comes highly recommended. Lunch at the Primetime Cafe was a great way to kick off our Dapper Day event. And our final tip for having your best Dapper Day is to get creative. Last year I had made some vintage holiday accessories which came in perfect timing for the holiday outing. Local thrift stores and vintage shops are great resources for Dapper Day outfits. But since you're attending a theme park, I also recommend checking out vintage fashion reproduction brands like Vivian of Holloway. Reproduction brands are great for attending events like Dapper Day because they have modern sizes but still have that vintage style. And if you plan on going on more attractions, you might want to save your true vintage fabric from getting damaged. Aside from the high humidity, I was very comfortable in my reproduction vintage ensemble. The next Dapper Day will be this spring, and I hope to see you all there. Going to Dapper Day! Oh, yay! That's how everybody says it, right? Dapper Day! I think so. <laughs> Pre gaming. Nap video. Nap video. Pre game nap video. Just enjoy the AC. We're gonna creepily wait here and look for other people. <laughs> 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 filming random. Are you dapper? <laughs>